So first thing that they recommend doing is taking a look in the mirror and seeing how your breasts hang normally. Um, getting used to the idea of where they're sitting at on your body and if they're if one's a little bit lower than the other, you know, kind of taking note of that or being alarmed if you're noticing that. And so I recommend looking in the mirror, lifting up your arms, doing some movements to make sure that everything's moving the correct way. Um, and then with the actual breasts, doing a, you know, it, it doesn't have to be super thorough. You're, you're looking for any changes. So all, all breasts are going to feel a little bit lumpy or bumpy. You're going to find some funny things in them. You just need to find out what's normal for your breasts. So using the three pads of your three fingers, just doing a real uniform, small circles all the way around. Um, and then you can go up and down in a zigzag pattern all the way around, just feeling for any lumps, bumps, um, anything, you know, it can be as big as a peach pit or as small as a pea. Um, and then going out into waves like this, making sure that you're going all the way up into your armpit when you're doing this. And you're also looking for new nipple dimpling, wrinkles, red spots, funny looking skin spots, just any changes that aren't normal for you. And if you ever do find a lump or a bump or something that's never been there before, be sure to talk to your family doctor or your OB doctor or your midwife about that. That way they can kind of address that. So if you would find any, any new lump or bump or something that you've never felt before or anything that you're generally nervous about, you can always call to make an appointment and we may schedule a mammogram or we may schedule an ultrasound or we may just take a feel and educate you on what we think we're feeling.